and we're back on the Mountain Weekend Show. New park it is this weekend, and I'm at my most favorite restaurant in all of Park City, in all of Utah, in the entire country. Let's be honest, this is Bob Nielsen. He is the main man here. That means he's president, uh, CEO, co-owner. Am I missing anything, Bob? I think you've got it, Jen. Okay, so Bob, this started how many years ago, Cafe Rio? It was a little over 13 years ago. That long ago? Yeah, it's hard to believe. Wow, and the first one started in St. George, Utah, but now you guys have branched out. You're actually going to start taking over the country and soon well, to be the world. And uh, you've got plenty of awards to vouch that you guys are, you guys are good. Oh, thanks. You know, we were, we were. I don't know if you knew this, but we were just awarded the uh, number one Mexican concept in the country by Sandelman Associates. We didn't even know we were up for it, and uh, it was a customers rating and level of excellence and. The governor uh, was kind enough to declare April 5th Cafe Rio Day in and do a proclamation. So Should we go back to April 5th again? Maybe we I, need one every I, like I, season. We'd, we'd love to. Let's talk to the governor about that. When did the concept of Cafe Rio start? Because it's a great concept. It's fast, but it's fresh. I mean, you get in line and you go through the line, you order up, and I'm actually going to serve Link here in a second. They're going to put me to work. Um, and then you've got your food, you're ready to go. Right. Well, Steve Stanley, who is, a, I, I think, one of the greatest chefs I've ever met, a very good friend, uh, started this with Tricia Stanley. This was in a very small place in, in uh, St. George years ago. And it, you know, they just grew it on the grassroots and it, it grew and grew at, at, at five or six restaurants. We came into the picture, they were ready for a little bit of a change. And I was ready for change. We had a wonderful handoff, and we've been doing this for now going on six years. The concept's very simple. We use the highest quality ingredients that, you know, honestly, money can buy. Uh, as one example, we, we take fresh limes, and we will squeeze up to about a thousand limes in this restaurant every morning. Now, if you're the lime guy, you know, a thousand limes. Well, I want to know if I can get a job because I'm trying to get my arms toned. Well, I'll tell Is you. Is the job up? I'll tell you, that will tone your arms. I'm like thinking you. it's a great idea. Well, we're actually going to head back into the kitchen. Before we do that, though, you're how new to Park City? We've been here, oh, I can't remember exactly. It's about a year and a half, two years. We've had a fabulous reception here. The people are terrific. The community's great. The food, is, you know, is fresh. The freshest ingredients, the best ingredients, made from scratch in an open view kitchen. I can't tell so, you, I seriously cannot get enough of this place. I mean, I know I think almost everyone that works here, which is good or bad, I'm not quite sure, but we're going to head back into the kitchen. You're going to put me to work? Let's go for it. Let's go try it. Okay, we'll, we'll just slip past here. This is our romaine lettuce. You know, it comes in. It's the best romaine lettuce you buy. Our beans are made fresh daily. You've got the black and the pinto. The black and the pinto. You know, our creamy tomatillo ranch dressing that people just love. Oh, it's, Go wild over it. It has, you know, I think when I first came to Cafe Rio, it has somewhat of a lime, a lime taste to it, doesn't it? Yes. Is it well, almost in the rice and the dressing? Well, there's, yes, we use we use this very fresh lime juice. Let me just show you something. Look, see, one of the secrets is, look at how dark and beautiful that lime is. We only... A dark, a dark, gorgeous lime is sweet, rounded flavors. You get one that's light green or not so good. You know, it's they're not bitter, good. not as good. Okay. And that's kind of the uh, summary of everything. The avocados we scoop from hand every day. The tortillas, these, these, uh, the women working here. I'm thinking this is a good arm workout as well. Look, this is the best arm workout She's in the doing world. A great job. How are your muscles? <laughs> oh, yeah. She's you got know, great muscles. Look, look at these tortillas. Como te llamas? Huh? Como te llamas? Coquina has, has done these. These are the absolutely fabulous tortillas. And, you know, you can't get a homemade pizza very often today. Every tortilla, every taco, the amount of work that goes into that is just unbelievable. Watch this. Watch how perfectly she will roll this. How many tortillas do you think she rolls a day? Oh, shoot. Many, many hundreds. Even you know, in a day or two, approaching thousands. Uh, I mean, how long is there would you shift? Would you roll one for us? Gracias. Is there, what's the trick? Do you know the trick to this, or is well, it now, all in her now, secret? Well, it's, it's an art form. You see that? Boom, boom. She just tosses it. Now, you and I could work for this for hours. For hours. It's and, take me forever. And, it, and it's very difficult to get, you know, tortillas that are that perfect. Look at how round. And then you put them on. Put them on. This is about five, 600 degrees. 
So don't and touch. And do, do not touch. Do not lick. <laughs> do not. Whatever do, do you not, stay do, away. Right. And uh, it, it honestly, I think they're the best tortillas we've found anywhere in the world. We traveled Mexico, New Mexico, Texas all over looking for better tortillas. We came home and said, we've got the best we've tortillas we've ever seen. And do you know what? If you, have, if you come here, whether you get the burrito or you get your salad, when you get a salad, the tortilla is falling over the top. Right. I mean, it's just, it's huge. It's massive. You melt the cheese on there. It just, it's so, it's so good. Oh, free meal. And here's the best part about it. They have fun here. They yell free meal. If you want extra meat, extra cheese, you're going to be put on the spot a little bit. Now, here's my question. Can I put on an apron? Because we need to get Link in line. Because I'm gonna actually, I want to serve him. Well, we need uh, we need to get you washed up. Okay. Okay. We Do go I need a we go through. Uh, we'll get you a hairnet. Okay. We'll get you washed up. We're very very uh, vigilant on you know our washing and all those things. We you know food safety, making sure everything is not only the highest quality but is safe and good and perfect. Can I actually add one note on that really yep. quick before we toss out of this? Sure. But when I have been here, which is usually at least four times a week, I'm not lying, I have seen them cleaning underneath the tables, everywhere. I mean, they're on top. They're they're cleaning everything, the ovens, the stoves. I mean, right. they really do a good job. You guys keep it well, clean. Well, I'll here, tell so. you, to, it, to be spotlessly clean is first and foremost. You know, the, the other things that we really care about is perfect food. Every meal, every, every meal of Masterpiece is the same that, you know, it just it has got to be perfect. And then the team members that your family here. And, and that's the recipe. They've got a great family. Do you think I can make a masterpiece for Link? Well, we'll see. I think you can. Okay, Bob, let's get me all suited up and ready to go. Okay, so we've got a few sinks around. Uh, we wash our hands, you know, very, very often throughout the day. We also wear gloves. I mean, we take every precaution. We've just got to, it's just simply we want to be safe and clean in everything we do. All right, I'm going to do this. Hola, sir, what can we get for you? Hola, que tal, como estas? Oh, muy bien. Ah, bien. Yo quiero una ensalada de carne, por favor. Sí. What kind of meat? Carne. That would be beef. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> now what I'm going to do is these beautiful tortillas. We bring them over here. We put some cheese on it. We get them a little bit more crispy. We grab one of these. Okay. Okay. Rice and beans. Sí. See. Sí. See what kind of beans? Um, frijoles. Uh, not the the lighter beans. So Not the black hot. beans. Pinto. Okay. And you said beef. Yeah. Yeah. How's that look so far? Pretty good. Look good. It, it looks, looks good, good over there, doesn't it? Okay, beef is right Mucho here. Mucho queso. I like a lot of cheese. You got the cheese, sir. But I'll I know. You, you want more cheese? I don't know. You look fabulous in your uniform, Thank by you. the way. Do you like my hair? Where? <laughs> How do you guys do in your hiring? <laughs> good. Mom? Yeah. yeah. You know what? He's doing beef. Oh, I'm right? yeah. doing beef. Oh, come on. Let's more? Load it up. Oh, okay. Load it up, more, baby. Load it know, up. This is like the lady at the ice cream store. You just yeah. The fat lady at the ice cream store, man. All right. Any sauce that's too good? Um, give me the hottest sauce you have. You really want a hot sauce? See, si, porque no. Bob, which one is it? This one? Yeah. Oh wow. Bob wants more beef. Right. Okay. Bob, you know, Bob's a man. He makes it down. So okay. Okay, we're gonna speed this up. A little later. salsa rojo. A little red Good sauce one? on okay. there. And uh, maybe just a little sa un, un poco crema. Oh, you can handle it. Uh, you, it's all right. Do you want extra? Do you want extra cheese? The extra cheese extra and. Cheese. Yeah. Extra cheese. Nice. Can I just use my hands? No, you're good. Hands. We're just working down. There you okay. go. Okay, sir. You want Any everything on it? Anything else? What else? You think I'm good? Good, sir. Good. Uh, we're, all, we're all good. Totally but in. You want everything on it, right? See, si, con salad? todos. Okay. Lettuce? I got lettuce. Don't go shy. Okay. Oh, yeah, okay. More? More. Okay, is that good? More. Seriously? Oh, we don't hold back. Okay, we don't hold back. You can't be real. Oh, how about a little guac? A little guac, okay. Not too much pico de gallo, that's okay, good. Okay, one. Uh, no. Avocados that are hand scooped fresh every day. Hand scooped fresh every day. Little bit of cilantro? Pork, yes. A little bit of cilantro. Cheese? No, no guac. Yes. And the creamy dressing? No. Oh, no dressing? Okay, but he does want Oh, yeah, the chips. you can put the creamy dressing on. Go ahead. May I help you with the chips? Absolutely. And then, guys. Jen. Then all we have to do is check out, but don't forget your Cafe Rio card, because that's where you get the stamps on the 11th. You get a free meal. Link, how's it look? Oh, fabulous. Hey, Bob, can I get a job? 
Hey, not bad, not bad. What do you think, everyone in the line? Yeah, give her a hand. You gotta come check Cafe Rio out, Bob. You're awesome. Cafe You're Rio awesome. is the best restaurant. I'm not kidding. They're gonna take over the country. There's my beautiful salad. I'm pretty proud. I am. All right. Well, with that, gone with more from the Mountain Weekend Show. Stay tuned. Here you go, Lincoln.